Hey guys, welcome back to the Long Dark. We are back in the challenge world because, in all honesty, I'm just really enjoying it. I mean, I don't, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the cheating. Maybe it's the like glitch that gets us all the hours that makes me enjoy it. But there's something nice about just walking from place to place without like having to worry about a long-term survival strategy. Maybe I should just play some of the lower difficulties a bit more. Looks like this has been here a while. I'm pretty sure I like don't need food in this game been a while so I have to basically at the start of every video I just have to refresh myself on precisely where I am yeah tons of food more oh yeah we did get a rifle that's nice pretty sure we just got ammo in here uh, this looks like some vague cabin somewhere I don't remember where where we are in coastal highway Conditions good. It's almost night, so I probably came in here to sleep. It's always it's funny. It's like uh, if you've seen the film Memento, which I highly recommend, and I don't want to spoil. Um, if you've seen the film Memento and know exactly what it's about, it kind of feels like that every time I'm starting up an episode. I'm like, wait, where am I now? Okay, so drink some broth. Probably should drink in that one first. That's how long it's clearly been. Guess I can literally just sleep. Is there anything else? Do I have to repair clothes? I should probably craft some birch bark whatever. Oh, I can make... Oh yeah, I guess I can. I'm not going to bother with that, but I can. I won't make this because I don't want to throw away the birch bark as tinder. Which will just happen because it's it begins with a B. So it's like the first priority for tinder, which is super annoying. It really just shouldn't be. But I understand why it is. All right, clothes. Um, all in all, solid. Everything's above eighty except this, and seventy-seven is not even that bad. Uh, I don't have two cloth though, so I may as well take this just in case I need to repair later. <laughs> I probably dropped like a hundred cloth in the last episode, for all I remember. Pass um, a little bit of time just so we're not like. I guess it doesn't matter if I'm walking at night. Especially because this is some random place, isn't it? Why am I here? Why am I not in one of these specific locations? That's the question. I came in here probably just to sleep, so I'll just do that. But I have no idea where in Coastal Highway I am. I don't remember. But clearly... I'm heading towards the abandoned lookout, I think. Wow, it's really that late. Probably just past time. I'd rather not walk outside at night when I don't remember where I am. fun watching the number tick down a little bit. Okay. I probably passed a little bit too much time, but I'll just sleep a little bit more. Uh, like an hour, maybe. I don't need to get fully... I don't need to fully recharge my fatigue meter. Because we can do that when we're actually in the location. Assuming I don't just glitch the timeout again, which I will try to do. But that doesn't mean I'll be successful. It was something like you drop an item, you go in and out the area real fast. Okay, where the heck am I? Oh, yeah, right here. Oh. That's probably why. So I can probably keep going this way. There might be a bear along here, but that's probably the place to go. I don't even need to loot, but, you know, habits and all that. I don't know why, but I used to think books were kind of rare. But, like, they're really just everywhere. 
And I don't mean like rare, rare, but like I used to thought, think they were like not abundant. <laughs> I'll put it that way. Until more recently when I started playing again and I, re I, I researched this place. When I realized that books are literally just everywhere. So I think we'll just be climbing. I'll check this place out again. Just see what's in it. Uh, of course I searched it. Okay. Well, when there's a rope, you climb it. Unless you don't want to climb it, in which case you don't. Put that on a, a holiday card. I'm too heavy. Not by much, though. We're probably coming straight back down here, so anything I leave, I can probably just pick back up. Probably just be food to drop, wouldn't it? Hands are heavy. Keep the MRE. And I don't know, too cold. Should probably come back down this way. Assuming I'm going where I think I am. We're nowhere... Well, we're in Coastal Highway, so this has to... For some reason, I was thinking, what if we end up at the plane crash in Pleasant Valley? That'd be quite the magic trick. I've been up here once upon a time, but it's been a very long time. I haven't been up here in... Like, years. Since before story mode came out, let's put it that way. I'm pretty sure. But I think I have been up here before. This feels familiar. Although, to be fair, this sort of level design is very common. It's not only here. You know, the go up to a rope to, like, this small crevice with a cave, and then you go up to the next rope. That's very common in a lot of these uh, regions. So I, I don't necessarily remember this one in particular. Did I miss it? Or is there just... Is it a deployable rope? Maybe I have to go around some other way. So... Okay, this is still a good view. So I'm guessing that up there you could deploy a rope to get here. But I don't see the actual rope. That kind of looks climbable over there. So maybe there's something up on that side. Could maybe glitch, but that's kind of risky. Just like walk around here until it forces me to fall. Let me just do one quick check in case I'm really blind. Is it like a terrain climbing thing? Because that really, the way that's shaped really does look like there should be a deployable rope up there. I just can't see. I'm just guarantee that there's no like terrain thing over here. And then I'll go back down if there's clearly nothing. Yeah, it doesn't seem... Seems like this is not for us, but it's still good to explore. I just have to find a different route. I haven't looked at any maps recently, so I don't remember the alternate route. I'm not sure I can carry much more. But I should be able to find it. Now, we are a little tired. I probably should sleep. But I'm not going to do that. So there's... I feel like we came that way. Or do we come that way? Because that could be a way up. All the way around. Or maybe this is. I feel like last time I was over here, there was a bear. Just rabbits. 
So I need to be cautious. But let's just sort of explore. Because I don't know what's down here anyway. Even if it's unrelated. It, it's kind of cool to just explore regions. That's interesting. Do they really make you walk all the way like up and around? Or is this... Where else would this be? So the lookout's all the way over there. Maybe this is... Like by the gas station? So I, I'm pretty sure that was a wolf over there. Can't see down there. Yeah, definitely a wolf. So we're going to have to use a bullet. Probably. Where did you go, buddy? Did you go back down, or are you still going up? F in the chat. <laughs> I mean, I don't actually need any of this in this game, but I also need to not be dead, so... Let's just see where this takes us. Even if it's, like, completely the wrong way. I'm trying to sort of see... can't really... I guess there's just an upper area that brings you there. Very interesting. That, if... Did I hear a bear? Just a crow, maybe? If that rope is like what I think it is and you can deploy a rope to get up there that is certainly worth doing if you go up there often because that is quite the shortcut it does seem like this is how this is designed you have to go all the way out here just to get to there so I wonder what else is up here like it, there could be like really good loot locations I just never realized Weather's not the best, but we do seem to be heading where we need to. Now, I don't know if this time passing glitch thing, I don't know if that's going to work for a lookout that isn't an interior. Because I think the glitch happens because you're like exiting an interior and going to the exterior. Or vice versa. It has to do with the loading, probably. Whatever Unity is doing. But either way, we can always just uh, sleep past time for the three days. I hear crows, I think. Which probably means we're getting close because there were crows up on top. This looks interesting. Just the way the snow is on this road. Like, what else is up here? There must be other things. There's a whole lookout, but there's a whole other road up here. Are there, like, those caves in Coastal Highway as well that let you just, like, move between the region? Even put some uh, oak trees up here. Oh. 
Burdock? How have I not seen this before? Maybe I just haven't been looking. Take that. I would like to find a rope just so we can head down faster. Yeah, I was right. Interesting. Maybe I'll use that. Also, it said we're already discovered the abandoned lookout. Does that mean we're there right now outside? We actually have to enter. Also, not a good day to be at the lookout. Not gonna lie. You can barely see. Right, it's this one. Yeah, I kind of remember. Not really, but a little bit. Um, I'm not going to take... Did I say I gave up on Revolver? Yes, I did. Ooh, I did not give up on that, though. Back in my day, it was a rifle cleaning kit. Interesting. These are all, these are all really nice. I just don't need all of these. Keep two just in case. I don't... That's even overkill, but... I don't even think this can's worth the hassle. Eat some nice dog food. Not because I need to, but because I enjoy it. don't think that I can just like leave the area. Let me try doing like a drop an item, walk a little bit of a distance away and then come back and just see if that does anything. Because it really depends on how the uh, bug is happening. Can I go around this side? Yes. So let's like walk back to the road and then we'll turn around and come back. Because you never know, could be... If it works, it saves me a lot of time. I still wonder where that heads off to. I don't think it's going to end up working though. It's probably something to do with the scene loading. I don't really need the acorns. We have so much food. Did I not go far enough away? Because it doesn't say the location name. Anyway, I'm not going to really waste time trying to get it to work. Wait. Oh. Oh. I'm pretty sure I called it Bardock. I guess that <laughs> that goes to show. Hmm. Yeah, Bardock. Uh -huh. I probably won't end up using it, but it's really cool. I love that they added all this stuff. What would I need to do? I guess I would just cook it. And in principle, I could use it for certain recipes. So, let's sort of just... uh. Do the usual. And then we're really... We are pretty close. Actually, it's just one more here, isn't it? It's just the garage. And then it's Desolation Point. Need water, not food. That's really going to make me do this, huh? 
Gonna make me just waste three days. Is this what the challenge is supposed to be? <laughs> why did, why can't it just bug? Point one. I should probably drink neat first. No, stopped. It's, oh, wow. Now, see, that is the view that I want. Let's go actually see it properly. That is quite the view. Now, that makes it worth coming up here. You can legitimately see, like, most of the region. You can see all the way over there where... Is that the, like, docks? And they're just so far away that they don't really render as, like, anything other than rocks? I think it, there's, like, a bridge, at least. Sort of, like, dock area. You can see some stuff that way. And then... Wait, what the heck? Oh, those that's a f fishing hut. I was like, is that an aurora bear? Like, that would be freaky. I guess I can... Does this help? It actually kind of does help a little bit. We have uh, the... I forgot the exact name of the... Jackrabbit Island. And the house that's on there. We have the whole coastal area. We can see like every single... Um, ice fishing hut. Although they're less important now, aren't they? We have that island. I can't see any wolves. I wonder if I could see a bear from up here. Oh, I like that. You can see it like it go <laughs> it changes the point where it renders in. Okay, and then there's some more docks, which means actually yeah, so that is going to be the gas station area then. Makes sense. And then you can see the ice sort of going that way, and that's towards desolation point. If we look on this side, uh there's a lot less to see. That's really cool. I really like that. I love the visibility in this game. This is one of those games that really does make me wish I played at 4K. I do love the 144 FPS, but... Just ha being able to, like, see so much further would actually make this such a, like, improved game. But this is still great. I remember when I first played this game and I barely had a gaming computer. But it still was okay. Just couldn't play it at max. It is really cool how like well optimized this game is. Point eight. Just gotta waste more time. It gets a little bit darker because the sun's like overhead and stuff coming through the window. You can still pretty much see a lot. I don't think I actually looked under there.
kind of want to play like one of the older builds of the game. Like I really love all the updates and stuff, but just for nostalgia, it'd be fun if I could find like the exact build that I used to play on. I mean, that's the hard thing, right? Because when we all talk about being nostalgic over the long dark, we all are nostalgic over different points in time. For me, it would be like just before Timberwolf Mountain was added or like around that time. That would be sort of, I guess, like the main time that I played the most. Whereas for a lot of other people, it would be like before they even did the uh, graphics rework. Almost nighttime, I'm gonna have to drink and then sleep. That's an entire day already gone. <sighs> always nice getting our food down just so we get way more <laughs> the next time we loot an area. Look at that. Oh, there was snow. Maybe it was just the last particles. Okay, we're halfway there. Still have a little bit of broth left, too. That's good. So if we're halfway there, then six hours brings us another half day. No, that's 12 hours. Brings us another quarter day. Another good visibility day, just a bit windy this time. Feel like the weatherman. <laughs> I'm always going to notice that this doesn't line up now, now that these are not perfect squares. It's weird how it took me so long to notice. Let's just make sure. Yeah, okay, we have plenty of time. I just don't want to pass time and then be super tired when we have to leave. It's not like there was a mini snowstorm for a moment. Oh, look at that. It's all on one screen now. The music in this game is just so great. I'm pretty sure this is the song I use as the outro for this series. It's hard to know because after doing the um, the Afflictions Guide, I use so many different pieces that it's hard to remember which ones I've used for which. But I'm pretty sure this is uh, this series. But in fact, the video is not ending here. Unless. That'd be kind of funny. Like an abrupt cut. In the middle of the night, we have 0.6 more days. 0.6. 6 tenths. Uh, I'm good at math, I swear. I can definitely do that in my head. Um, I'll eat this. This is like good calories, so I'll just start eating it, but... Gives me some water. And it gets rid of a can. Slowly. Need more water. I'm glad that that snowstorm happened now instead of in a moment. Okay, point four. I 
Okay. Now I'll just sleep however long I can, which isn't going to be eight hours. Maybe I should have drank. I'm probably going to be fine. I was completely fine. And we still haven't even made it our entire time yet. Must be like an hour or two off, though. Point two. Then I'll sleep like another two and that should be it. Although I might not be tired enough to sleep a whole two, so I might have to skip another hour. Nope, that's good. I really should crack these open and get rid of them. I've been holding on to these since the plane crash. Which I went to before Timberwolf Mountain, didn't I? I carried those through so many regions. They're almost new to water, but it's probably fine. So I'll take that now. Oh, hello. It's just guarantee. Band and lookout, three out of three. I thought that was a bear. <laughs> it's the way the rock moved. I hate when my rocks turn into bears. Um, I probably could just go down the side, couldn't I? I'm really curious where that goes, but I kind of need to go this way. Uh, maybe. This doesn't look too bad. Yeah, it looks doable. Yeah. Nice. You have to climb one more rope, but we're fine. <laughs> oh, yeah, let me just take this rope and put it up there. That will make it so much easier. Imagine if there's a lasso skill. So you could, like, deploy a rope above you if you, like, lassoed it. That'd be kind of ridiculous. I love rabbits. Rabbits make me feel better, because it makes me think that there isn't actually a wolf. I mean, a bear over here. Either way, I probably should just head this way. I could probably go down to the road. But it, it shouldn't matter too much. It's this way-ish. Yeah, the ice is, like, right there. But face first into a tree. Is it always called the garage? Why am I thinking it's called the gas station? Am I just mixing it up? Or was it called the gas station the last challenge. It technically is both, right? It technically is a gas station and a garage. But the naming is strange. Okay, I guess I'm going down. Is this the bear area? It's so weird. That's the weird thing about coastal highways. How many, like, layered, like, roads there are vertically? Like, each height layer has its own sort of ro road backbone. Which is very strange. But it's kind of nice. Okay, so I don't think I've passed it yet. And it's weird, because, like, you can't even look up and see the other one. Which is very interesting. But it's like tiered roads. Okay. 
Okay, I'm just keeping an eye out because I don't want to be bear surprised. Yeah, that trailer, I'm pretty sure we're getting close. I think to the right, we'll just have like a walkway straight down. That kind of scared me. <laughs> that music note. Is that the bear cave? I don't know. I saw a bear around here once. Okay. Wonder if we'll have the moose in this game. Probably not. Either way, there do tend to be wolves around here, so I'll be careful. Gets mauled and <laughs> loses the series. That'd be really funny. Yeah, that's the one thing I'd say about this challenge, right? It's not particularly hard. Oh my god. I didn't know the bear could come down here. Okay, that kind of makes sense. This area is even more dangerous than I thought. But that's like the one thing about this challenge, right? It's not hard. But you put so much time in that if by some chance you lose it. Oh my god. And this is exactly a situation where you might lose it. I'm just going to go straight inside. Not worry about it. I'm going to forget about that if I... <laughs> I forget that that guy's there. Oh, especially because I need to, like, cheat it, right? I need to, uh, I don't need the casing. Drop the casing. No, drop the casing, I said. Crouch, go outside. Go inside. Tell me it does the thing. It did the thing! I swear I figured it out. You drop an item. Maybe even crouch. I don't know if I've crouched every time, but there's something about... Oh! Well, this stuff will come in handy. You know, I really didn't anticipate actually finding one. But, yeah, anyway. I could probably keep going. I think I'm going to leave this episode here. There's tons of food. There's a bear outside. But I, I could say that success, figuring out. I don't understand. So it must just be... What would it even be? I dropped an item. I left and came back. And somehow, the whatever it's doing to manage the time when it transitions scenes, and notice it, it messes up when I come back in. That's when I get the achievement, not when I leave. Also, what's with these windows? <laughs> That's a little much, I'd say. But hey, we're finally here. We're in one of the last locations. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope you're as happy as I am that I don't have to actually sit here and just waste time and in the next episode we will head to crumbling highway and then desolation point so there should only be one or two more episodes of this challenge and then we can move on so i hope you guys enjoyed see you in the next episode <laughs>